I'm going to show you how to set up the show hide module with a single unit and a group. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to put down a rifleman, place him right about here, face in that direction, and then we're going to go to independent, we're going to go to looters, then men, and then looter with a shotgun. We're going to place this guy right about here, face in this direction, and we're going to give him a waypoint just a move away point and that's it. Now normally when you start your mission this guy will be right here and will move to the waypoint. Let's get to the show hide module so what we do is we go to F5 systems and then we go down to where it says object modifiers and then to the second one at the bottom is the show hide module. So you click on that and let's just place it in front of our looter guy and let's go over the module. So double click the module and the only thing you need to worry about is these two settings right here. So you have apply to and you have action. So apply to you have synchronized objects only, group of objects, synchronized objects and objects in synchronized trigger. Now since we only have one unit that we want to hide we're gonna set it to synchronized objects only and then you have the action which is hide units and then show units we want to hide units we we'll just hit OK and what you need to do is you would sync that to this guy but before we do that we're gonna place another module so we're gonna copy this module press control V and paste it over here and then we're gonna edit it so now you see it says synchronized objects only for the action we're gonna have show units we're gonna set it to show units then we're gonna hit OK we're gonna highlight both of these right click and then go to sync to and you're gonna basically sync that to the unit so we have hide units and we have show units so when the mission starts this module is gonna hide the unit and then that's it nothing's gonna happen what you need to do for this unit to be shown or spawn in other words is you're gonna need a trigger to trigger this module to show this unit and follow his waypoint. So we're going to go to triggers, place a trigger without a size, we're going to place it right about here, and we're going to just expand it a little bit, and we're going to make this square, and we're going to set the activation to blue 4 present, because we are blue 4, and we'll just hit OK. So let's uh, adjust this trigger a little bit, and let's expand it so that we actually get into it. Alright, so now that we have our trigger, you're going to right click the trigger, and you're going to go to connect, and then sync to, and you're going to sync to the show part of the module. So we know this is the hide module, this is the show units module. So what's going to happen is, when I enter the trigger, this is going to open this or unlock it, and it's going to show the unit and the unit is going to follow its waypoint. Alright, let's try that out. Alright, as you can see, there is no unit there. So if we walk forward into our trigger, the unit appears, he moves to his waypoint, and there he is. How do we do this for groups? Well, for groups, it's the same thing except just a different setting. So we'll just keep this as it is, and for groups we'll go to groups, and let's put down a fire team, place these guys right about here, and let's just have them right like that. So for groups, yes you need to connect these two, so we'll connect them, sync it to the group leader, but then you need to update the module, so we'll go to this module, you need to change this to groups of synchronized objects as it, it's a group now. So just hit OK and same with this one. Set it to groups. Just hit OK and that's it. That's all you need to do. So now when I start the mission the group won't be there. But when I enter the trigger the group is shown 